Welcome to Graph Tutorials, I'm Shiva and in this video I'm going to take a quick look at the Opacity Mask in Adobe Illustrator. So an Opacity Mask is a sort of a combination between the Layer Mask function in Photoshop and the Clipping Mask function in Illustrator and it is defined by black and white so it's not defined by the shape or the physical area of a vector path. So for an, for an opacity mask, you need something you want to use with the opacity mask and something you, you want to use for the opacity mask. So for this one, I'm going to create a rectangle. And the opacity mask needs a gradient. Now the gradient can be either which color, but it gets transformed into the grayscale of that color when making an opacity mask so it's easier to just begin with black and white and I'm going to apply my gradient to my rectangle. So now I have my picture I want to use with the opacity mask and I have my rectangle with the gradient I'm going to use as the opacity mask. So when you have both of those things you select both of them and then you go to window and there you choose transparency and then you get the transparency window and here you can make your opacity mask. Now we're going to click make mask and as you can see your opacity mask has now been created. So clip is automatically selected for you uh, from the beginning and what clip does is it keeps your opacity mask within your created mask area. So if you deselect clip, as you can see now, you still have your opacity mask, but it's it's still in the area of the shape you used for your opacity mask, but you see everything outside of that shape also, and it's not influenced by your opacity mask. So if you clip your opacity mask, it is contained Everything is contained within the shape of your opacity mask. Now, you can invert your mask, which basically inverts the mask. Um, by clicking this one, you can prohibit that your art is linked to your opacity mask. So if you move around, then you can move the art separately from the opacity mask. And... If you want to adjust your opacity mask, you have to select it here. And then you can adjust your gradient and everything you want to adjust for your opacity mask. You can also alter option click your opacity mask and then you can also edit it. The only downside here is that you do not see how your edits affect your your artwork. So I myself find it easier to just edit like this without the old option click. And if you're happy with all this, you are happy with your opacity mask, as you can see here in your layers window, we are now in the opacity mask mode. Your artwork isn't visible, but it's, it isn't gone. If you want to exit opacity mask, editing opacity mask mode, only thing you have to do is click here and then you stop editing and your layer is back. So that was a quick video on the opacity mask in Adobe Illustrator. Let me know in the comments below if you liked this video. Also press that like button. If you did, press that subscribe button to see my future videos. And for now, stay creative and I hope to see you in the next one.